What is up guys? We're here with some Pokemon Mystery Dungeon uh, DX for Deluxe. Uh, this is going to be a brand new playthrough on my channel. Hope you guys enjoy it. This is a remake of um, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team and Red Rescue Team actually. And wow, my headset is like really loud. Um, let me see what I can do with that. It's like I can't hear a darn thing. But, okay, yeah. So this is a brand new Pokemon Mystery Dungeon game for the Switch, the first uh, Mystery Dungeon game on the Switch actually, and for those that have played the Mystery Dungeon games before, um, this is just a, a remake of it, updated like technology and all that stuff with the graphics. This is the portal that leads to the Pokemon world. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. Oh, ask away. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay. Let the interview begin. So one thing about the interviews too for the Pokemon game is like, if you don't like the Pokemon that you end up being assigned to, you can always choose who you want at the end. And I'm not sure if, if the Pokemon I end up being assigned to is what I want to stick with or not. You receive a gift, but you don't know what's in it. You're curious, so what do you do? Uh, I open it now. <laughs> That's like the only right decision to do in my opinion. The road forks to the right and left. You were told there is treasure on the right side. What do you do? Uh, yeah, it's a trap. We're going left. <laughs> have you ever made a pitfall trap? I have not. That's kind of weird. Do others often call you childish? Actually, no. In fact, they call me very mature. Can you go into a haunted house? New. <laughs> <laughs> You're going bungee jumping for the first time. Since it's scary, you decide to test the jump with a doll. The bungee cord snaps. <laughs> Will you still try? <laughs> no. <laughs> what? If I tested it with a doll and it snapped, ooh, it's not gonna stay there with me on there myself. Do you like to noisily? Do you like to noisily enjoy yourself with others? I guess. It's a weekend, but no one would play with you. What do you do? Hang around. I mean, none of these are true. I guess huddle in a corner? Uh, if my corner's my gaming setup? <laughs> I don't know, because hang, hang around vacantly, it just sounds weird to me. You go huddle in a corner. Do you want to play as a boy or a girl? We play as a boy. A little boy? And then I can't remember if that determines like your partner's gender or not. Oh, I tend to be lonely. I want to always act cheerful and jocular around other people. But it's only because you are with other people. I wonder if this is going to give me Cubone because I wanted to do the playthrough with Cubone. <laughs> However, when you're alone, do you find yourself feeling oddly depressed? That's why you always want to be with others. It's not good to go around feeling depressed too much. God dang, Pokemon, you're getting deep. Why don't you call up a friend instead? Just remember, it's not a bad thing to feel lonely. You know what it's like when you aren't alone, so that's why you feel lonesome. And that's why you aren't really alone. A lonely person like you should be. Yeah. <laughs> and it's funny, because my first playthrough for Pokemon, I think, uh, Red Mystery Dungeon on the Game Boy Advance? I think it was Game Boy Advance. I got Cubone as my first uh, pick for myself, so this works out because I wanted to see if I would end up getting Cubone again, and I did from that test, so yes, we're going to go with Cubone. And then for our partner Pokemon, uh, who would you like to have as a partner? Uh, honestly, we are going with Squirtle. I don't know which would be like the the best to go with. And we're gonna do girl just just cause. Um, Squirtle, what do we what do we call you? Um, we will call you Renee. Did 
I even get to choose my character's name? I don't I don't even know if they let me choose my character's name or not. <laughs> Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. Excuse me. Please wake up. Come on, wake up. Yo, what's good, Squirtle? You're finally awake, great. Oof. Where is this? You were passed out here, I'm glad to see you awake. I'm Renee, happy to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around here before. Huh? You say you're a human? But you look like... A normal cube bomb in every way. <laughs> well, what you talking about, Willis? It, it's true. I have turned into a cube bomb. But why? I don't remember anything. Um, you're kind of weird. Your name? What's your name? My name, that's right. My name is... We're not just going to go by cube bomb. We're going to go by... B -b 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 blades. Wow, you're just gonna laugh at my name just like that? Somebody please help. Hmm? I hear shouts over there. What's wrong? It's horrible. My cat fell into a cavern. My poor baby. What? A huge fissure opened in the ground and my cat fell in. He's too young to crawl out by himself. When I went to get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Huh? You were attacked? By the Pokemon? They must be enraged by the fissure and are out of control, that's what I think. I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? My baby will be... A food. Duh. Oh, what am I to do? Oh dear, oh dear. This sounds bad, we have to go help. I, I mean, I guess. Even though I just turned into a Pokemon and I don't know my moveset. Ah, Tiny Woods. Could this be a mystery dungeon? It is, it's a mystery dungeon. A mystery dungeon is a truly mysterious place. Oh, I wouldn't wouldn't have guessed that from the name. The layout and the items change every time you enter. You can proceed by using the stairs, but you'll have to find the stairs first. And you remember that Butterfree said Pokemon in the dungeon attack, right? If necessary, we have to fight. Let's do our best, Blades. Uh, yeah, we're just... Alright, we know headbutt. That's good to know. Oh yeah, another thing about about these um, games is like in order to in order to to make your moves like a bit stronger, like it's, it's like you have to use it more often. I'm trying to see what the I'm trying to remember because there was like an auto button that would just like have him the auto automatically like progress through the dungeon. Yellow, teammates green, items blue, Pokemon that are enemies are red and stairs are white. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Look at that. Move settings. Okay, we know Headbutt, Bone Club, Brutal Swing, and Brick Brick. Wow, we have a nice little move set. Oh, you know Brick Break as well. Wow, that's kind of... I did not know he was going to know Brick Break. Um, I wish he didn't know. But Brutus Swing seems kind of... Kind of clutch. What's the... There should have been a way to, like, pull up the... Uh, 
Oh, okay. The, the right button is like the auto. Oops. <laughs> or left. My fault. <laughs> left is the auto button. So now we can just have him like walk through himself and go to that last room. Okay. What does right do? Okay, this is how you can... Uh, does Brutal Swing make it, I think? Oh, Brutal Swing... Okay, Brutal Swing has two tiles. That's actually convenient. I didn't know that. Uh, we want to we wanna fight still. Because I want, I want all the EXP because this game... This game really punishes you for... Not being at like an appropriate level, I'll say. Why would you use Water Gun out of all moves? I guess Water Gun's the only one that that would make it? That's the only thing that makes sense to me. I would go for that last Pokemon there, but... Uh. We need to get the show on the road. Wah! Mommy, where are you? We came to rescue you. Huh? Your mom's waiting. Let's get you out. Oh, okay. You just go with strangers that say they're here to rescue you. <laughs> and just like that, we successfully completed a rescue at Tiny Woods. My baby's safe. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could ever thank you properly. Oh, that's okay. It's been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures like that one. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, may I have your names at least? I'm Renee. And this is Blaze was good. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm, I'm pretty cool. My guy. He's, uh, staring at me adoringly. <laughs> Those sparkly eyes. It's a little embarrassing. But this doesn't feel bad, either. It's like I'm a hero. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. Thank you, Renee and Blades. I know it isn't really enough, but this is a token of our thanks. Please accept it. You got a tiny reviver seed. I love the reviver seeds. They come in clutch so much, like, as we progress through harder dungeons. I used to always have, like, at least... I try to keep, like, five reviver seeds on me. <laughs> because you never know, like, when you're going through, when you're just going to get, like, one hit KO'd or something. Do you have any plans? Uh, no, I'm actually homeless, bro. Or sis. <laughs> Listen, Blades. If you don't have a place to stay, you should come with me. Oh, thank you, Renee. <laughs> I was going to sleep on the dirt <laughs> with my ground type and so. <laughs> well, this is the place. Wow. I can't explain it, but I'm happy. I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel weirdly happy. Oh, another thing, like, based off, like, the starter that you choose, I think that is what decides on what, um, your house is gonna look like. It might be an instinct thing for Pokemon. Maybe this is what it feels like to want to wag your tail. It doesn't matter, I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm a Cubone. Oh, Blades, you're impressed, aren't you? I thought so. I thought this would make a good place for you to live. I was sure you would like it. This is your mailbox. They deliver mail from other Pokemon here. Many other Pokemon are suffering from these natural disasters, just like the Fissure Caterpie fell into. There have been all sorts of natural disasters recently. I want to do good. I want to help Pokemon like that. I want to help make the world a safer place for Pokemon. So, um... Well, I saw how good you were when we rescued that Caterpie. Would you like to form a rescue team with me? I think we could be the world's number one rescue team, Blades. What do you think? Um... Form it? <laughs> Whole point of the game? Okay, done deal. For now, and Blades, we're partners in our rescue team. I'm so glad. The team's name is... I haven't decided on one. Listen, Blades, what would be a good name for us? <laughs> Grit was what they were going with. So, anytime I've played, I've either been like Pokemon like Team Shadow, or I've always gone for something like technology-wise where I'll be like, oh, like Team Cyborg, so... Uh, I think we're gonna be... Can we put Cybernetics? Team Cybernetic? Cause I don't know if they're... If they're gonna add on... 
uh, the S to it, like when people talk, so I don't want to have like cybernetics. So we're just going to be team cybernetic. If I can fit the C there, yeah. Team cybernetic. Or cyber zone. Cybernetic, cyber zone. Team cybernetic. Team cyber zone. <laughs> okay, we're going with cybernetic. <laughs> I like it, it's a good name, it's perfect. Oh, and one more thing. I wanted to wear this on the day I got started on a rescue team. I have two of them, so let's put them on. I put on the scarf I got from Renee. Oh, it's yellow. It looks great. You wear it well, Blade. Oh, thank you. Don't you feel focused like we're on the same team together? Rescue Team Cybernetic. Well, I mean, we have different colors, so I don't feel like we're on the same team. Rescue Team Cybernetic, let's do good. It's starting tomorrow. I wish you could choose the color of it, because I would definitely be like, why don't we just wear, like, yellow? <laughs> yellow or blue? And that is how Blades and Renee began their careers together as a rescue team. So I think the difference between uh, Blue Rescue Team and Red Rescue Team were the um, exclusive, like, Pokemon you could recruit, and I think in the deluxe version now uh you can get all of the pokemon the next morning well the all the pokemon that are available currently in this game are generations because we can't be an axe i'm still the same the way i look i'm still a cubone but why would i be transformed into a pokemon hmm. i don't understand this at all oh that's right that pokemon i think it was renee we made a promise to form a rescue team together. I wonder what Renee is doing. I should go out. You just sleeping out outside? Okay, that's that's weird. Huh? Oh no. <laughs> Sorry. I was so excited about today. I've been waiting here since dawn. I must have fallen asleep. Anyway, today marks the start of our rescue team. Let's always do our best. But, uh, we don't have any job offers yet, huh? I mean, there's mail right there. What's in the mailbox? <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe there's something in the mailbox. Yes, thank you. <laughs> We're gonna check the mailbox, and the mailbox contained a rescue team starter set. I knew it'd be here. It's the rescue team starter set. They always give you one if you start a rescue team. Renee opened the rescue team starter set, and there was a rescue team badge inside, a toolbox, and an issue of the Pokemon News. Yes, there are some good things here. First off, the rescue team badge. It shows that we're a rescue team, and this is the toolbox. This is what we use to carry items in the dungeon. Let's put the stuff Butterfree gave us in here for now, because items are very useful, so let's use them on our adventures. And finally, a copy of the Pokemon News. It's useful for rescue teams. I'll put the Pokemon news in the mailbox. You should read it later on. Yep, I'll most likely do that. Is there any other mail? Hmm, maybe not. The mailbox was empty. Okay, so there isn't any mail for us after all. If there were any rescue jobs, we'd be getting mail, but nobody knows about us since we're such a new team, I guess. <laughs> Is that the Pelipper? Oh, I wonder what it could be. Yep, it's the Pelipper. Oh, so I was like, standing here waiting for Renee to do something. <laughs> Maybe it's a rescue job offer. What does it say? Bzz, bzz, bzz. I heard about you from Caterpie. Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. A strange electric magnetic wave flowed through a dungeon and it stuck Magnemite and Magnemite together. This isn't enough to form a Magneton. It's not complete the way it is now. Please, we need help. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Magnemite's friend. <laughs> what do you think? We sh yeah, let's, let's go. Huzzah! Thunderwave, man. It's, I guess now it's like such a good feeling seeing uh, these dungeon names from before that I played. Oh, you're here. My friends are in the cave. Or in this cavern. This, this. 
My friend should be on B6 floor. Please help them out. We surely shall. Oh yeah, hunger is definitely a thing. You can press B to open your toolbox. It's quicker than going from the X menu. Oh, okay. Yeah, that fighting move came in clutch. Oh yeah, I'm definitely happy with my choice of choosing Cubone. You don't move, neither will your opponent, so take your time. Brick breaking you. Oops. I need to change up those buttons, actually. Um. So I kind of want to make the right button be the button for auto, auto run. This is, this is just because I want to pick up as much as possible. I'm like, let's try to be fast with this. Brutal swing goes pretty far out. Ooh, who leveled up? Oh, I leveled up. Okay. Okay. Ouch. Man, we both hit the level up. Oh, your defense is nice. 17? But your special attack is kind of trash. <laughs> Who's this? Get on fine. Got that level up too. By pressing. Oh, I didn't even see that Pokemon over there. Oh, there's items up there. I guess we'll just go to the next floor since we're right here. I don't see any other items going to be on the floor. swing out here to do that damage. Yeah, Wonder Tiles are also pretty, pretty clutch. Oh, there they are. Let's get them out safely. Sweet. 
Proud of myself. <laughs> Our bodies separated. Rejoice. Yay. Uh, yay? <laughs> Be thankful, you two. You are our heroes, thank you. Ah, uh, we got a big apple, an orange berry, and 650 Poké Dollars. Or Pokemon Coins, whatever they're called. I'm so glad our rescue mission went so well today. I need to confess, since that was our first job as a rescue team, I was really, really nervous. I can't believe how tired I am. I'm going to go home and get some sleep. Let's do good again tomorrow. See ya. Where? Where am I? Maybe... Is this a dream? Oh. There's someone here. Who is it? Someone I know? Mm, I can't remember. I think I dreamt something, but I can't quite remember what that dream was about. Oh well, today's another day of rescues. I wonder if I have any mail. Better check the mailbox. And guys, with that, I'm going to end this episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, oh wow, look at that. 1,500 Poke Coins, and we're at rookie level for our rescue team rank. But make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps with the video a lot, and also subscribe to my channel. It helps the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.